Welcome back. It is Riker 1122 again. Uh, so, as we've said last time around, we are actually picking up having unlocked all of the Forge Towers. We have to start on the quest for collectibles. So, we will drop down onto this Ithildin rune first. Um, this time around, I know I get easily distracted in this game, but I am off to try and keep the focus on collecting. I'd like to try and collect as many things as possible per session. It might be a case of I go around collecting everything in areas. Uh, so if we look on the map, you can see each area has its own name. So what I'd like to do is do at least the barrows do the Uden foothills at Blackgate and if you get a chance the Black Road. That is the plan. If I can get anything extra done on top of that, brilliant. If we don't manage to do that, I'm expecting it's because our captain's got in the way. Nani here, Galar Mordor. If you didn't notice it, I'm, I'm starting with the excuses before the session's even started. These are Ithildin, Starmoon, forged of Mithril. They hold memories of the ancient past. The knowledge within may be fair or ill. And kill every slave in the land. <laughs> I hate it. So sometimes he says things with the runes, other times he ignores it completely. I know I gave nothing for rescuing these slaves as such, but it makes me feel better. And in, in, in this regard, it was two easy kills. And, but again, doing the intelligence on them. I'm never sure if it's worth it or not, purely because you don't gain anything other than a name, you gain a location. Just thought I'd grab the blue flower while it was there. Because it's one of those things when you're looking for them, you can never find them. When you're not looking for them and just randomly see them on the map, they're everywhere. So there is a, an easy way to do this through the tunnel system. Whether I can do it or not is another question. I believe it's this one. Ooh, 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 we have a an outcast mission. I am <laughs> Okay, so it runs straight into another group of orcs. Yeah, it's just draining. I know I've got the max hours out of him, so I couldn't really get anything extra out of him, but it works. First artifact, double. A serpentine blade. So on these, we look for that little glowing symbol. Remember me, filth. <laughs> what the? Change of plans, lads. I'm in charge. And we're gonna tear the black hand up. Don't you forget about me! Oh yeah, right. My uh, 
Memory's not that good. So what we'll have to do, rather than run back out of the cave, we will just fast travel back to the tower. How can man hope to stand against these Uruk? They are filled with such pure hate. We will teach them the meaning of fear. And in that, we will give hope to Middle-earth. That is just a standard outcast mission, so we will drop. We'll do this bow shoot bow first. Because unless I'm mistaken, we need to kill 15 orcs in 30 seconds. On the plus side, they are weakened, so it is literally just a shot to charge the shot to do anything complicated, other than shoot them. And that has given us now the hit points, oh, and the focus exposing increase, excellent. I didn't realise we'd have gained as much as that. And it, however, looks like the outcast mission that I was planning to do next has disappeared. Or the rescue of the outcasts has disappeared. Oh no, we need elf shots. It now means I'm out of hours again, which is the, the whole one of the reasons why I attacked that group. You're gonna die. No, we can't get there because there is a roof on that section of platform. Oh, no, it's just nowhere to grab hold of. A coded journal entry. With a crow attached to it. Here's what I saw. I told you the orcs are digging everywhere. Well, they've dug huge caves into the ground in the side of the hills and in the mountains where they do their work. Some of it's forges, and they got blacksmiths making armor and all kinds of weapons. They save on metal by making their armor for the front only. Like they're not planning on retreating anymore. Oh, and they got these huge pits too. Bigger than I've ever seen. They pull the new orcs, maybe a hundred or so a day. Some of them are those Urukai. You can tell them right away, because they've got a head or so on other orcs. They come out fighting and immediately start bossing everyone else around. No one's the wiser about me spying. But don't send no more clothes. The other orcs might get suspicious. They are tough and they're not stupid. We underestimated our enemies. They are forged for one purpose to destroy the world of men. So we have the Fallen and an Isildun wound down here. We'll grab them both. Whatever it was can sort off. Stay on your guard. It might come back. <laughs> Elven Swiftness. Oh, I didn't get the clean headshot that I thought I did. That was 
disappointed. Leave, we need to do three stealth kills. Five stealth kills. Three slaves, five stealth kills. And shooting them at range with arrows does not count as stealth kill. So stealth kill is that. Help us, please! But you can just drop them quickly and take any pressure off yourself. I am in your debt. Can you hear me? We need help. Uh, many thanks, Ranger. Oh, great, we have a patrol cruiser. Because if I kill that one. Then everybody else will see me. See Still me. having trouble staying on your feet, slave. <laughs> if you're not using your legs, maybe I'll just break them for you. <laughs> All three stealth skills done. Don't fall asleep now, slave. <laughs> Rush him! Stop moving! <laughs> Okay then. It, that guy killed him for me. That was horrifically dumb on my behalf. And I am not pleased with it in any way, shape or form. The bonuses are I got kill out of it. I can barely feel my feet. So sometimes they provide intelligence on captains. But I'll find the strength to run. Thank you, Ranger. Wrong button. Upgrades. We have another ability point. So we can now unlock, unlock, unlock ride characters. We have enough for the elven shot of increase. Uh, I still don't have any runes to attach to them or any runes are worthwhile to attach to them, so we will ignore that. And that's now unlocked, so what we'll do is come back later to deal with that. We will push north and try and get these four up here. So it now looks like we have the ability to. Oh no, because we've unlocked everything in tier 1. It now says we need to complete storyline missions and do power struggles to then unlock the next tiered stuff. Let's play catch. So I'm assuming the intelligence person is up here. There it is. This time round, it is documents. Let's just make sure we've got access to everybody on the front row. 
and we work through our second row now. So he's an archer that is vulnerable to still to ranged kills. So on a successful shot, does that count as a good catch or a bad catch? The first messengers have rolled into camp. They're reporting few casualties. We've struck a mighty blow against the forces of Mordor aligned against us. Let it be so, and not fools idle chatter. Hagedorn, what news? <laughs> they say we've won a monumental victory. You'll not be needing all that Athelis have been grinding, my friend. Few need healing on this day. And more's the wonder. They say the Golden King has brought back a prize. Sauron himself. We're in the heavy chains! Excellent news. I have lived Yeah, it's still just the uh, unlocking of the level 2. My life on the boundary of Mordor, thinking it was dead. Never knowing the stories it held. The land of shadow is awakening from a long slumber. It has many stories yet to tell us. Ooh, he has venom. Venom? is a, an awful thing to fight against because it means you lose the ability temporarily to see when to counter or when to dodge it's a pain in the ass to fight We're looking for the red ones of the same design. Okay. I need a weapon out of the forge that'll cut the talk in two. Iron shackles. All right, worms. Welcome to the Black Gate. You'll be building our watchtowers for us. Hard work will be rewarded. Sir. Do you mean hard work will be rewarded with a shorter sentence? The traitors, the lot of them, murderers and thieves. When I say reward, I mean I won't throw you to the categories. Thank you. These men are not soldiers. They are not ready to die. All things that live must die. Man alone faces the mystery of what is beyond. <laughs> Don't stop fighting, Ranger. <laughs> you filthy maggot. I have no intention to stop fighting. <laughs> <laughs> that, that didn't quite go as um, planned. Thank you, Ranger. He was moving too fast. Torturing a soft skin by cutting his throat. Killed it in minutes. Minutes? Surprise it lasted even that long. Wait. Nothing here. Upgrades. There are still only weapon groups. We need a lot more for them. You must have been here and things. Back to work then. Then we've got another one just here. Pick up. Huh? Escaping slave! Lord dead! 
underneath, I believe it. No, no, it's on top of it. Yeah. Here it is. What do we get this time? A lot pick. Sir, the situation is very confused. How is it confused? I see the prisoners escaping, running towards the gates, which seem to have blown open by sorcery or sabotage. Archer, stand down! Sir, we're not wasting good arrows on those people. They've served their purpose. They're damned. They're damned well out of my hair. Mordor can take the whole stinking lot of them. And send my compliments to the captain of the gates. I suppose he sent me this lockpick as some sort of joke. The place we want to be is the one place we are doomed to stay. And the outcasts fled into it to escape Gondor. And it is here that the Dark Lord will gather his armies like pieces on a game board, unless we stop him. I thought I was really hoping that we'd get so many orcs in one place. That meant there was a captain there. Ah, goddammit. I'm not even sure what we're actually aiming for now. So let's do the outcast followed by Ithildin. Ooh, there's even a worm down there in the form of a slave. Thank you. Please help me rescue my brother. He's far too stubborn to work for these Uruk. I feared the game crashed them. So get this Ethelden room. I bet you're too soft. This is the end! A Karagor! <laughs> we need three Karagors. Where's the cow go? I felt very much it was lying to us then. Not another one of these slaves will escape on my watch. So we've got two down there for the Black Road. So we, like I said, clear the Black Road so I'll come down here. Oh, yeah, I know he's not part of the. Gives us anything else not cast, but. Off the edge. Watch out, he's got So you get more points for a, for a stealth kill than you do for a grand execution. That kind of makes sense. Oop, there's three of them over there. Walking towards me, I thought second door headed away from me. Let's just grab all the ribbon and drain him. Draining, I'm not interested in interrogating. I'm quite curious on how much a, a drain kill gets me. More than a bow kill. Something 
something about him that can drive the bravest of Uruk out of battle. Jim. He's in jail for a reason. For saying what we're all thinking. You want to live forever? Plow in this field? The elves lord it over us. Don't they just? Sauron's right. We can live without pain. Without growing old. And you want to go to war to make that happen? I want the king to listen to good ideas. Well then, he should have nothing to do with Sauron. Fighting with the elves is not a bad idea. It's the worst idea imagined. No blood of Numenor is in my veins. I am a Northman, an exile. Phallus never let me forget that, and Yorith never cared. To the Eldar, all men are the followers. Fleeting visitors who soon pass beyond the circles of the world. I'm ready for a good war. Who else is with me? It's a shame that there is no... <coughs> ...worms nearby. Just getting that little bit of information out about him. <coughs> Before we did that, it's been quite nice. All my lads know I'm hunting you down. They're preparing a feast for when I bring back your head. See, I'll have a long... Oh, oh, okay. So I can't jump him. can shoot him, though. Now let's just drop him. And let's watch them all flee in terror. This, I believe we need to kill 20 orcs. 10 with headshot. Fortunately, we do get unwanted arrows. The downside is, they get to shoot us too. So if you're not moving, you can take quite a bit of damage to this one. So as you can see, they have the advantage of being on both sides, it's not just one place. And if they hit you, they knock you out of focus. Impressed that he shot me through the tent on the previous shot. Oh dear. Last chance attempt, but because he's not got a shot in time. You oh, 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 Dave, I did not know never come to this could happen during a mission like this. So we don't have any information on that. And he's, I wouldn't say strong, stronger than what I was expecting. Okay, so I can't jump in. Enjoy living in the knowledge that you are beaten. <laughs> so, because I stunned him? He... what? We need to understand what he's about. Ah, 
that's confused me a little bit on how we just put them. So we've unlocked the point, but because we haven't done anything with, to do progress our power level, we don't have access to tier 2 stuff yet. We do, however, have access to hit points. And we picked up a few runes. Blade Master, not interested in picking up at the moment. Uh, so I am bouncing back onto one of the towers. What I might do is jump back up to this one. So the next time we come into it, we'll have to do the Fell Beast. Um, and if I'm correct in thinking, that takes us quite a distance out of where we're meant to be. So we'll see where we stop before we find out which is the next area we clear. So again, we've come back to the tower because that is the end of this episode. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, please hit the like button. And I hope to catch you next time round, where we will continue doing the collection on the side quests and collectibles. So again, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye.